Hello everyone, I'm coming to you guys today with a quick skin care routine. Um, I only use four products and I'm just going to share them with you guys. So, this, I just wash my face with this every morning. This is Biore. I think I'm saying it correct. Um, let me see. Yeah. It's called Biore. This is the baking soda pore cleanser. Um, this is for combination skin. I have dry spots and oily spots on my face, so this works perfect for me. Um, Biore also has, um, some for, like, they have some of these, they look a little bit different, but it's for dry skin, and they have some specifically for oily skin, but I have combination skin, so this one is perfect for me. Um, and this is a new bottle of it I bought. I don't know if they changed it or what, but... It's the same thing. It's it say this one got twenty five percent more in it. Um, it's the baking soda pore cleanser. It's the same thing. It look a little bit different. So yeah, if you go to the store and buy it, it could look like either one. So just wanted to show y'all both of them. And I just wash my face with it every morning with my spin brush. I put it that on my face and just use my spin brush to clean it. And I wash it off with a washcloth. Um, then after I do that, I get this witch hazel. It's the T.N. Dickinson's witch hazel. Um, it says for the face and body. I just get a cotton ball and, you know, put the witch hazel on and just rub it all over my face and let it dry. And then the final step, and this right here, I do it sometimes. I don't do it every time after I put the witch eggs on on there. Sometimes I just leave it like that. But, you know, I use this right here sometimes. <laughs> this is 100% aloe vera gel. Uh, I guess the company is called Fruit of the Earth, but this is what it looks like. I got mine from Walmart. Yeah, this it's 100% aloe vera gel and I just you know I just massage that into my skin and that's it and this is my last this is the fourth product that I use this is also by Biore let me turn it down a little bit yeah this is the called the pore strips and you use it on your nose let me see if you guys yeah this is the Biore the charcoal pore strips and it just goes on your nose like on the picture you wet your nose a little bit you put it on there i think you leave it on for like you leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes and take it off and i only do this like once a month i only use these little um nose strips like once a month maybe twice a month but if you're washing your face every day with this be already cleanser then your nose probably only needs it like once a month um those are my four um skin products i don't use much on my face this is a very simple routine i'm a very simple girl so it works for me it's easy i do this first thing in the morning when i wake up i just wash my face with this put the witch hazel on it um sometimes i do aloe vera gel i rub it on to my face sometimes i forget or i <laughs> just don't do it um yeah so these are my two consistent these are the only two things I use consistently every single day. I wash my face with this and I put this on with a cotton ball and let it dry. These two things, I do these as I think, I use the aloe vera gel as I think of it. Or just, you know, whenever I use it from time to time. I probably use it about a good three days out the week though. And this right here, I use like once a month. And it's a nose strip to get the pores in your nose clean. And y'all, that is it. This is a very simple routine. It's only four products. And y'all, it has made a difference in my skin. My skin is not perfect at all, but I have been able to tell the difference in my skin, y'all. I used to use alcohol on my face when I was in high school. I have no idea why, y'all. I, <laughs> I used to get alcohol and put it on the cotton ball and it just rubbed my face with it. And it dried my face out so bad. My nose used to peel my forehead and like, up on them like my eyebrows the skin on my eyebrows used to peel like it literally looked like my eyebrows had dandruff in it so y'all it was bad but thank god for this stuff y'all this stuff is good i love this i love this y'all this and this witch hazel is a must have like i said my skin is not perfect because 
Oh, yeah, and if anybody watching this video, if y'all know what I can do, like, I feel like it's like a couple dark spots on my jawline that I have. And this, like I said, this is just a facial cleaner and, you know, witch hazel, so it don't lighten up dark spots. It's just, you know, a facial clean cleaner, but it makes your skin so smooth, like, and I haven't had any bad acne. Like, I used to have pretty bad acne in high school. I haven't had... Like, hardly any acne. I might get a bump here and there, but nothing often at all. Like, I used to have bad acne. Like, them bumps, like, they used to come on my face, and they would hurt, like, to the touch. But thank God for Biore. And, y'all, I love it. Y'all need to try it. This is so simple. A little simple routine. Some quick. Because <laughs> I know some of these YouTubers will tell you, oh, I got a little simple routine. And then they'll put like 10 products. And you be like, who got time to use 10 different products on their face on your face in the morning? Like, ain't nobody got time for it. This is simple for products. These are the two that you need to use every day consistently. Um, you should probably should use this one every day consistently. But as you think of it, you know, if you think about it, use it. If you don't, it's not really a big deal. Um, and this you use this once a month. And you good, y'all. And like I said, um, this here um, is for a combination skin. But they do have other ones for just dry skin. And they have another one for just oily skin. So y'all just check out like the whole line of their products. And see which one will work for your skin. But I love BRA. Thank you guys for watching my video. And y'all just have a blessed day.